Hello, and welcome back to our channel. I'm truly honored that you're here with me today. Whether you've been with us for a while or it's your first time, I want to personally thank you for joining this special moment of prayer and reflection. Today, we are going to focus on something so important, breakthrough prayers for your home and family. Our homes are where we find peace, love, and connection, but they can also be places where we face challenges, struggles, and spiritual battles. That's why it's so important to cover our homes and families in prayer, to invite God's protection, healing, and restoration into every corner of our lives. Whether you're seeking peace, unity, financial provision, or healing within your family, these prayers are designed to call upon God's favor and bring His presence into every situation. I believe that as we pray together, God will move in powerful ways, ways that will transform not just our homes, but our hearts as well. So if you're ready, Let's prepare our spirits for what God is about to do. Remember, prayer is not just about speaking words. It's about opening our hearts to receive what God has already prepared for us. It's about trusting that He is always working on our behalf, even when we can't see it yet. Before we dive in, I want to take a moment to welcome anyone who's new to the channel. If you're here for the first time, thank you for being part of this community. We're all about sharing faith-based inspiration, prayers, and encouragement to help you grow spiritually and navigate life's challenges with God by your side. If that sounds like something you need, I encourage you to hit the subscribe button and tap the notification bell so you never miss out on our uplifting content. By doing so, you'll stay connected and continue receiving encouragement through powerful prayers and motivational messages. Together, we'll keep building our faith trusting in God's promises, and seeking His breakthroughs. Now let's get started and invite God into this moment as we focus on breakthrough prayers for your home and family. Opening Prayer Heavenly Father, we come before you today with hearts open and filled with faith, believing in your power and goodness. We welcome your Holy Spirit into our homes and into this sacred moment of prayer. As we lift up our families to you, we ask for your divine presence to rest upon us, let your peace that surpasses all understanding fill every corner of our homes, driving out all fear, doubt, and anxiety. We seek your guidance, protection, and provision, knowing that you are the source of every breakthrough. Lord, we surrender every burden, every worry, and every situation that weighs heavily on our hearts. Help us to trust in your perfect plan and your unfailing love. We believe that you are working all things together for our good, even when we cannot yet see it. Strengthen our faith to stand firm, no matter the challenges we face, and remind us that you are a God of miracles, able to do exceedingly and abundantly more than we could ever ask or imagine. We place our families, our homes, and every need before you today, trusting in your mighty hand to bring restoration, healing, and breakthrough. May your will be done, and may your name be glorified in all that we do. In the name of Jesus we pray. Amen. Segment 1 the importance of prayer in our homes. Prayer is not just a ritual or something we do in times of need. It is the heartbeat of our relationship with God. It connects us to His will, aligns our hearts with His purposes, and brings His peace into our homes. As James 5.16 reminds us, the prayer of a righteous person is powerful and effective. This scripture encourages us to believe that our prayers can shift atmospheres, break strongholds, and release God's divine power into our situations. Think about that for a moment. When we pray for our families, we invite God's power to intervene, to heal, to restore, and to protect. Imagine a home where prayer is a regular practice. A home where each family member lifts up the other in prayer where negativity, fear, and anxiety are cast out, and the presence of God reigns over every room. This is what God desires for us, homes filled with His presence, families rooted in faith, and relationships strengthened by prayer. When we pray, we create an atmosphere that welcomes God's grace and love. Even more, prayer builds a spiritual hedge of protection around our families, keeping the enemy's plans from succeeding. In Ephesians 6.18, Paul tells us to pray in the Spirit on all occasions with all kinds of prayers and requests. This means prayer is not limited to moments of desperation. It should be a daily practice covering every aspect of our lives and our homes. 
Let's be intentional in creating a culture of prayer in our homes. It can be as simple as praying together before meals, offering a bedtime prayer with your children, or setting aside time each day to pray as a family. These moments, no matter how small, bring us closer together and closer to God. When we pray together, we not only invite God into our own hearts, but we invite Him to dwell in our homes. We make room for His peace, His protection, and His provision. Prayer fortifies our families and strengthens our bonds. It allows us to face life's challenges not in our own strength, but with the power and confidence that come from knowing God is with us. He is listening, and He is working. So as we prepare to enter into prayers of breakthrough for our homes and families today, let's be reminded of the power we hold in our prayers. Our homes are sacred spaces, and through prayer we can invite the presence of the Almighty to fill them with love, peace, and protection. No matter what you're facing today, know that God is with you, and through prayer He will make a way. Segment 2, Scripture for Breakthrough Before we enter into breakthrough prayers, it's important to ground our prayers in God's Word. The Bible is full of promises that bring hope, peace, and assurance of God's power working in our lives. One such promise comes from Philippians 4, 6-7, which reminds us, Do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation, by prayer and petition with thanksgiving, present your requests to God, and the peace of God, which transcends all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. This scripture gives us a powerful formula. Instead of letting worry take root in our hearts, we are to bring everything to God in prayer. Not just some things, but everything. As we lay our burdens at His feet with a spirit of gratitude, He promises to guard our hearts and minds with a peace that surpasses human understanding. This peace is a protection that shields us from the storms of life. As we pray for breakthrough in our homes and families, let us hold on to this promise of peace and trust that God hears us and is already moving on our behalf. Another scripture that resonates with this is Psalm 91, verse 1 to 2. Whoever dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. These verses remind us that when we choose to dwell in God's presence, we find rest and protection. Our homes become a sanctuary, a place where God's peace and presence abide. As we pray today, picture your home being covered by God's protective wings, His angels surrounding every door and window, keeping harm at bay, and His peace reigning over every heart in your family. So as we move into specific prayers for breakthrough, I encourage you to meditate on these promises. Let them strengthen your faith and remind you that God is not only able to transform circumstances, but also desires to bring peace, healing, and unity to your family. Keep this video playing in the background as you go about your day, and let these prayers be a constant reminder that God's presence is filling your home, protecting, guiding, and providing for your family. Let God's Word guide your heart and your prayers. Trust Him fully as we lift up our families to Him in faith. Segment 3, Breakthrough Prayers Now as we enter this sacred time of prayer, I invite you to pray along with me. Whether you speak these words aloud or quietly in your heart, remember that prayer is powerful. It is our direct connection to God, and when we pray in faith, believing that He hears us, the heavens move on our behalf. So let's come before the Lord, humbly and expectantly, for breakthroughs in our homes and families. One Prayer for Protection Heavenly Father, we come before you, recognizing that you are our shield, our fortress, and our protector. We ask for your divine protection over our homes and families. Surround every corner of our homes with your heavenly angels, guarding us against all harm, danger, and attacks from the enemy. May no evil befall us, and no plague come near our dwelling. Lord, we declare boldly that no weapon formed against us shall prosper. We ask that you dismantle every scheme and plot of the enemy that seeks to harm our families. Cover our children, our loved ones, and ourselves with your mighty wings and keep us in the safety of your presence. In moments of fear or uncertainty, remind us that you are our ever-present help in trouble. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 2. Prayer for Unity Father, we lift up our families before you, asking for unity and harmony in our homes. We acknowledge that true unity comes from you alone. 
Help us to love each other as you have loved us, unconditionally, without reservation. Let our home be a place where love is spoken freely, where understanding flows, and where forgiveness is always extended. Lord, remove any barriers or misunderstandings that cause division among us. Help us to communicate with kindness, respect, and empathy. Teach us to be slow to anger and quick to listen, always seeking to understand rather than to be understood. When disagreements arise, give us the wisdom to handle them with grace and the humility to seek reconciliation. May our family be bound together by your love, a love that is patient, kind, and enduring through all circumstances. In your precious name we pray. Amen. 3. Prayer for Healing Heavenly Father, we bring before you the wounds, hurts, and pains that exist within our families. We know that no hurt is too deep for you to heal. Lord, we ask for healing, healing of broken relationships, healing from past traumas, healing from words that have wounded us, and healing from physical ailments. You are the great physician, and your touch brings wholeness and restoration. Where there has been anger, replace it with peace. Where there has been betrayal, restore trust. Where there has been emotional pain, bring comfort and renewal. For those in our families who are suffering physically, we ask for your healing hand to be upon them. Ease their pain, restore their strength, and bring them back to full health. We trust in your ability to restore what has been lost and to mend what has been broken. In Jesus' name we pray for complete healing. Amen. 4. Prayer for Provision Lord, we know that you are our provider. Every good and perfect gift comes from you, and we trust in your faithful provision. Father, we ask that you meet every need of our families, whether it be financial, emotional, or physical. In moments where we feel the weight of lack or uncertainty, remind us that you own the cattle on a thousand hills, and nothing is beyond your power. We pray for breakthroughs in finances, that you would open doors of opportunity, provide stable jobs, and bless the work of our hands. Help us to manage our resources wisely, and to be good stewards of all that you have entrusted to us. We ask for peace of mind in knowing that you will supply all our needs according to your riches in glory. Let our hearts be filled with gratitude for the ways you have already provided, and let us trust in your continued faithfulness. In your name we pray. Amen. 5. Prayer for Spiritual Growth Heavenly Father, we come before you with a desire to grow deeper in our relationship with you as a family. Ignite within each of us a hunger for your word and a passion for your presence. Lord, help us to seek you daily, not only as individuals, but as a family unit. Guide our prayers, direct our thoughts, and inspire our conversations. Teach us to worship together, to study the Bible together, and to live out our faith in unity. May we model Christ-like love to one another, and may our home be a beacon of light and faith to those around us. As we grow closer to you, we ask that you fill our hearts with your peace, your wisdom, and your discernment. Help us to raise the next generation to love and follow you, and to leave a legacy of faith that honors you. In Jesus' name, we pray for spiritual growth and transformation. Amen. Segment 4, Closing Reflection As we close today, I want to remind you that God is always with you. He hears your prayers and desires to bless your home and family abundantly. In moments of joy and in times of challenge, know that His love surrounds you and His presence is a constant source of strength. Take a moment right now to reflect on the specific prayers we've lifted up together. Consider what they mean for your life and the lives of those you love. Keep these powerful words close to your heart, allowing them to guide you in every decision and interaction within your home. Reflect on the blessings that God has poured into your life, both big and small. Perhaps it's the laughter shared over a meal, the comfort of a warm home, or the support of loved ones during tough times. Cherish these moments and recognize them as gifts from Him. Hold on to the hope that God is always working behind the scenes, even when we cannot see it. He is actively aligning circumstances, softening hearts, and opening doors for breakthroughs. Trust that every prayer is a step closer to healing, restoration, and the fulfillment of His promises in your life. As you move forward, let this be a reminder that your faith is powerful and transformative. Look for opportunities to manifest that faith in your daily interactions. Speak words of encouragement to your family members. 
express gratitude for the little things, and extend kindness to those around you. Imagine how your home could be a sanctuary of love and faith, a place where everyone feels valued and uplifted. Each small act of love and every moment of prayer contributes to that atmosphere. So, as we wrap up, take this spirit of prayer and reflection into your week. Let it inspire you to create an environment filled with joy, hope, and unwavering faith. Your home can be a light in the darkness, and your family can be a testament to God's love and grace. Closing Prayer Heavenly Father, we come before you today with hearts full of gratitude. Thank you for this sacred time of prayer and reflection, where we can come together as a community seeking your guidance and strength. As we conclude this moment, we ask that you seal these prayers deep within our hearts. May they not just be words spoken, but powerful declarations of faith that take root in our lives and in our families. We pray for your divine intervention in our homes, bringing healing where there is hurt, peace where there is chaos, and unity where there is division. Lord, help us to recognize and embrace your presence in our daily lives. May we always feel your love surrounding us, reminding us that we are never alone. In times of struggle, let us turn to you first, trusting in your perfect plans and timing. We ask for your blessings over our families. Protect our loved ones from harm, both seen and unseen. May our homes be filled with joy, laughter, and an abundance of your grace. Help us to cultivate an environment where love thrives and where we can uplift each other in faith. As we step out into the world, empower us to be vessels of your love and light. May we shine brightly, reflecting your goodness to those around us. Remind us that our prayers hold power and that our faith can move mountains. In Jesus' name we pray. Knowing that you hear us and are already at work in our lives, thank you for your unwavering love and for the breakthroughs that are coming. Amen closing scene. Thank you so much for joining me today on this powerful journey of prayer and reflection. I hope these breakthrough prayers for your home and family have brought you comfort and encouragement. If you found this video helpful, I encourage you to share it with someone who may need a breakthrough in their life. Your act of sharing could be the spark of hope they need right now. Imagine the impact we can have together. Don't forget to like this video it really helps us spread the message further. And if you haven't already, subscribe to our channel for more uplifting and inspirational content. By hitting that notification bell, you'll be the first to know when we release new videos filled with faith-building prayers, teachings, and encouragement. As you go about your day, remember that God is always with you, guiding you, protecting you, and loving you unconditionally. Trust in His plans for your life and keep these prayers close to your heart. Let's continue to support one another in prayer, and I encourage you to make time each day to seek God's presence in your home. Stay blessed, stay hopeful, and let's walk this journey of faith together. Until next time, take care, and may God's peace and love surround you always.